our intentions are to create the virtual being of, of James Dean that's not only for one movie, but going to be used for many movies and also gaming and virtual reality, augmented reality, mixed reality, and beyond. What we typically do is we take all those images and videos and we run them through machine learning to, you know, to create that asset. So it's a combination of machine learning and artificial intelligence. Well, I think th there's definitely something um, cynical and what feels like a little bit distasteful about bringing especially long dead actors back to life. We may see more of it, but I also think the reaction to the likes of the James Dean news that has actually shown that I think most people don't really want that. Most audiences don't really want that. And I'm not convinced that they'd actually turn out and pay to see that stuff. Well, I think this is disruptive technology. I look at it a lot like the introduction of the internet or cell phones. I think there's a lot of people that when they get you know, introduced to new tech, they get a little scared. So again, I think this is so early stage that some people hear it for the first time and they get shaken by it. But this is where the market's going. The, the question isn't so much if you use somebody's likeness to bring them back or to, to create a digital version of them. It's, it's what you do with it yeah. and the respect that you show to Absolutely. it. The main question that you need to ask yourself is, you know, why do it? You know, uh, just because you can do it doesn't mean you should, you know. Uh, that, that would be one thing that I'm always questioning. Uh, is it in service of the story? At some point there's going to be the James Dean biopic. I think the technology is not necessarily there today to take the risk for a biopic on James Dean. I think this movie is the perfect first movie to kind of introduce him to the rest of the world. Our intention is to recreate James Dean to be, to be used over and again for different movies. And this technology is gradually going to become better and better.